Yet again, I cannot remember any of the names of the characters, but my. Yeah, but Jin, you have that, you know, <laughs> it's you know, if I was if I watch some awesome Finnish yeah. movie, I'd be like. That guy that did this and whose name had like five K's in it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, but this is Gone Girl and this is the Gone Girl from Gone Girl. So I okay, should, so remember. should remember. Amy, Amy yeah. Dunn. Amy Dunn. Amy Dunn, yeah. Or Griffin Dunn. I think he's in the movie because he's all of his husband or something like yeah, that. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, what do you like about her? Uh, I think she's awesome. I mean, <laughs> I, I, don't, I, I don't even think she's Case really closed. a villain. I mean, but she's a really good villain because... um. Well, there's a lot of ways to look at it. I like psychopaths. I yeah. mean, I like people who are just cold and calculating and just... Uh, or even incompetent psychopaths like Scorpion. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. It's, 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 a, it's a good quality to have as a villain. And the setup of not, this... Not as a friend, but as a villain. Yeah, no, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> a few, a few <laughs> psychopath friends is always good in a party situation. You killed a guy. You slashed his throat with a box cut. You went on national television. And begged for me to save your life. And I obliged. But I want that man. I'm leaving. You really think that's smart. Shampoo? But yeah, the, the thing about it is more this setup of this, um, this uh, woman meeting a man. And then sort of um, the man failing her in various ways. And then it turns out that this woman is not at know, all ordinary. <laughs> yeah. And then she sort of acts revenge on yeah. the guy in this way that is really cool and calculated and complex. And the ending also, when they finally make up yeah. in this really creepy but cool way. Because you have to, you just you know, you can't, you're kind of stuck. There yeah, with it yeah, and stuff. That's really well done in the book too, actually. And they go a lot, a lot, a lot into stuff with her parents and yeah. how, she, why she is who she is more. And yeah, the amazing Amy, Amy books yeah, and yeah, all that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. and yeah. it was just. Uh, I mean, and it's directed by David Fincher. Yeah, so yeah, it was so beautiful the film, and um, I don't know. I was just so fascinated by this character, and uh, and um, just because she is pretty relatable. Yeah. She's not this like over she's not when you look at her and when you look at Scorpio you oh, yeah, can't yeah. really Nobody's gonna, yeah. we should have him over for dinner one day. Nobody yeah, says yeah, that yeah. about Scorpio. But yeah. when you look at her you're like looking at something that is almost like me but not quite but I there's love the way it develops though. You yeah. Know, you see, and you know think oh nice people. Oh wait. Yeah. Yeah, and it's 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 really it's really beautiful. Is it the, because um, I haven't read the book, um, is the, how much do they go into that? Because obviously, if you make a film about a book, you have to cut out mm. oh, yeah, major sure, yeah. bits about it. Sure. And I understand you haven't seen the film. No. Yep. So, so we can't really discuss it in terms of that. But um, I mean, in the film, it's obviously there's a lot of stuff uh, going into trying to explain how Amy got the way she was. A lot but of there's, it has to do with the parents. Uh, the parents no. Yeah, yeah, but there's the also a lot mm. of stuff that you have, that, because it is basically a crime mystery mm. film, you, there's a lot of stuff that you have to cut out just to, to, to have that suspense mm. going okay, on. And, yeah, and also to make the... Because the, the, the point about movie villains versus, versus uh, villains in, in, in novels is also often that, that in movies you have to you have to omit and you can omit yeah. a lot of the stuff mm. you can you can create twists but not by just showing or deciding not to show certain parts of what's sure. going yeah. on mm -hmm. and that's so much easier in in films i mean mm. than in books because in books you have to have a if you have a character, you have to tell everything. You, yeah, yeah, to build up yeah. that character, you have or to sort of have why, motivation. Why don't you end up being yeah. like yeah. this? Yeah. Yeah. And then it's pretty hardcore, you know? Yeah, yeah. and the, the thing that I was interested about the book, how did they explain the, the disappointment with, uh, with uh, the husband? Oh, and it, it's funny because it's, you know, it's, it, it takes some real, real, I mean, at least half the book before you even get to, you start thinking mm. inklings of that. And, and you're thinking, and they're going over different 
things that had happened in their relationship, yeah. and you knew about these things that had happened, these events mm. that happened, but you knew about them in uh, everybody's perspective. Yeah, yeah. Her perspective is completely different from yeah. everybody. These were bad things. Yeah. When when the other things you're thinking, oh, these, this party and stuff, oh, that's kind of yeah. funny and stuff. Oh, they had an argument. So no, it's a that's it's, it's um, yeah. it takes it takes real time to the, the living up to perfection thing. It takes time to go. It's a really really well well done. And that book. is really uh, an interesting thing that changes perspectives. Yeah. Thing and no, I, I like things. That, I love yeah. movies that do that. When it's yeah. when you re watch something and at the end you're like, what I just watched was not at all what I thought I just watched. Yeah. You know? yeah. yeah. So. Yeah. And yeah. she had this point about uh, trying to be a cool girl. Yeah. Because cool girls get. Let's call it the goal, or the yeah. achievement. Yeah. And then. She did all the things that a cool girl was supposed to do. Yeah, but she never. She didn't get, but she didn't get the goal because her husband failed his part in this equation of cool being a cool girl. Well, if you're a cool girl, you get the goal. Yeah. And the husband didn't live up to the bargain. No, I know. So then. But I, but I think that it's also to, it's also about perspective because mm. it's also about it's also about um, is it Nick? His husband's name is Nick. Maybe, I think. Yeah. Um, so Ben Affleck's Nick is sort of also a, a, he's also fulfilling a certain role, mm. which unfortunately in his role role is is the is the philanderer is the yeah. is the no. guy who who uh, who's really charming and smooth mm. with with women and too smooth and too charming for his own good. Mm. So he, I, I think that Amy actually gets exactly what she's looking for, mm. but she just doesn't realize until it's too late that this is the, that that That's these are these is, are these yeah. are the kind of guys the cool girls get. Yeah, if yeah. you're gonna be this cool girl who eats burgers and and mm. hangs out with your with it with it with the mates and so on and so on, it's quite possible that that this guy, this hunk mm. yeah. that you've decided to be with, isn't exactly what you expect him mm, to be no. and then it turns around obviously and Amy yeah. is not what you expect, expect her to be at all, at be, all. Yeah. No. Yeah. and 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 then it and then it then it plays out to its sort of logical but chilling conclusion yeah and yeah. it's a beautiful thing really to see like I mentioned earlier it's a beautiful thing to see um, a psychopath that is relatable because then you sort of understand her actions like you understand the actions of a really good lawyer or an engineer who is thinking logically. Oh, sure. It's like watching Lee Lee Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like a xenomorph from the aliens and relating to it. And it's a fun experience for the yeah. viewer because you're sort of like, if you have a villain that is too much, you can't really get there. Well, again, that will get too, back to the essence yeah. of villainy and what makes a relatable villain. Yeah, makes true. A, someone you want to watch, a Darth Vader or a yeah. Scorpio or a Dean Warner. Yeah, or, yeah. You know. true, true. Yeah. yeah. Um, in terms of casting of the movie, I thought I thought Rosamund Pike was a really good because uh, I'd seen her in previous roles where she played this kind of prototype Amy, like uh, a cold, sort of calculating mm. person. It fits her yeah. persona very well because she looks the part. She's she's very beautiful and she's see she's you can obviously sort of sense that she's very intelligent mm. and and yet there's something unnerving. Mm. about her as, yeah. a, as an actress, yeah. which creates that whole, uh, that you don't, in terms, of, in terms of watching Gone Girl, because the, it's a very difficult role for, for, for the, character, the, the actor who plays Amy, because you mm. have to go throughout this yeah, really di yeah. difficult mm, yeah, arc. Yeah. And at no point in the movie, partly, obviously, also because the script was good and because it's directed by Fincher, but, but you, at no point in the movie did I feel that this is not, I wouldn't, I wouldn't believe that this mm. kind of person no. or this kind of, this kind of character would do people these, like that. Yeah. 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 And then um, when uh, Judy Dench comes as the, uh, as the air elemental, Right. <laughs> <laughs> that's important. I think, uh, we need a crossover from the Chronicles of Riddick so we can get that younger crowd. Yeah, yeah. True, yeah. True, so, true. And we can, re again, we can return also to the worst Bond movie all time, Die Another Day, because Rosamund Pike is in that oh, as the, as the well villainous, villainous yeah. woman. Oh, yeah, true, yeah. true. Oh.
they Paul needed Paul they needed the guy that was Wes in the Road Warriors. <laughs> they, they, got, they needed him too. Uh, uh, so. Yeah. Yeah, but I, I, I think that... Um, no, I'll watch the movie, but you guys should read the book, because I'm curious yeah. to see what your take on how the book compared to the movie is. I'm looking forward to seeing that. I didn't have time this week. No. Yeah, but well, it sounds yeah. like a really good book. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's 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 a it's okay. It's not a great piece of literature. Mm. It's a total page turner. Yeah. Yeah. No, no, yeah. No. yeah. And and in terms of it being a Fincher movie, it's got all those those. It has all those Fincher trademarks. It's 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 cold. Mm. Yeah. And it is calculated, and it's yeah. chilling, and it's very muted, and it's sort of understated, and it goes right for the jugular. Yeah. In in both figuratively and literally yeah. <laughs> in yeah. the yeah. movie. So. Yeah. Yeah, it's it is a really really good good film and a really good bad guy. Um, also in terms of of um, of turning the tables, because you rarely well, there's get, no good guy. No, yeah, yeah, really yeah that's no, that's no. true. But but in terms of there was there was an uh, uh, an article I read about this also that there is there there are no good guys in the film, but there's a whole it's a whole different level. Of cheating on someone, actually killing someone. There's a, there's oh, yeah, a, there sure. is a yeah. there that so. But but you rarely see those kinds. Still, even with what's going on in Hollywood now mm. and so on, you rarely see those kinds of performances written out for female actors. Mm. They don't That's get to true. do. They don't get to really explore the mm. that kind yeah. of darkness. Right. Uh, mostly the darkness is more to do with just calculating how you're going to get revenge on your husband for cheating on her. But it doesn't involve murder and it doesn't involve yeah. like, like a game. big plan like that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Yeah. And yeah. I think the, the maybe one of the best things about the movie is that uh, I was left uh, in awe of her at the end okay. of the movie. I wow. felt like, whoa. It's kind you of like don't that get that from the book. <laughs> yeah, you know, it looks great, and but you don't. I, I'm, 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 you don't think this is an impressive character no, or no. something, or an awesome no. character. No. Yeah, yeah, that's that's. I think that's that's a lot to do with Fincher and yeah. a lot to do with the script and a lot to do with Rosamund Pike. No, no. Um, but um, but yeah, it is. I, I think that I I'd like personally. I'd like to see more sort of female Hannibal lectures because mm. yeah. I I like that kind of character. I I wouldn't want to know one. No. But I, I, I like watching it's, those yeah, kinds yeah. of... Maybe you do know yeah. one. That's the great thing about Lecter. Is he yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that's yeah. possible. I'm sure there's but plenty I don't of people who think that you're one of those characters. <laughs> 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 there's a face, Facebook group, I think. <laughs>